from Mother's Prayers and Meditations, the 15th of June, 1913. Even he who might have attained a perfect contemplation in silence and solitude would have arrived at it only by withdrawing from his body, by disregarding it, and so the substance of which the body is constituted would remain as impure, as imperfect as before, since he would have left it to itself, and by a misguided mysticism, through the lure of supraphysical splendours, the egoistic desire to unite with thee for his own personal satisfaction, he would have turned his back upon the very reason of his earthly existence. He would have refused, like a coward, to accomplish his mission, the redemption and purification of matter. To know that a part of our being is perfectly pure, to commune with this purity, to be identified with it, can be useful only if this knowledge is later used to hasten the transfiguration of the earth to accomplish thy sublime work. <laughs>